Welcome sa ating channel. Mag-iisang buwan at mahigit na po tayo dito sa Custom Mechanical Keyboards Hobby. And here I am to share you one of the most exciting, if this is not the best, that I have got. This is one of the best. Pero para sa akin, ito yung pinaka-special na Custom Mechanical Keyboard so far na nakuha natin for the past month ng, uh, ayun, pagpupuyat sa custom mechanical keyboards, pag-explore, pag-research, and everything about in and outs of this hobby. That even I will be offered by around 7 digits, hinding-hindi ko ito bibitawan because this is, uh, paano ba, something na very, I mean, personal. Like, the value of this is not that uh, much din naman. Hindi naman ganun ka-OA or ka-exaggerated. Pero kumbaga sa mga lahat ng uh, collections ko na sa, uh, sa anumang hobby, this is something very uh, valuable for me. Na if there will be another chance na magkaroon ulit ako neto, sobrang labo na. I've tried and only one designer ang uh, nagbigay nun sa akin and that is Matrix Lab uh, with their Matrix 2.0 additional Mac Flurry Edition first Mac Flurry Edition with this kind of coating and more details that I will tell you later on how I made this and yes, for more videos like this sa ating journey pagdating sa custom mechanical keyboards feel free to subscribe this video is brought to you by SCD Key the best website that you may visit in terms of uh, very affordable deals and best offer para sa application softwares, games, and yes, operating system. And there you are, you may check the Windows 10 Pro. And by using our promo code, ma-avail mo lang siya ng around $14.95 or 700 plus pesos. That's it mga kaibigan, check the description below. May mga links po tayo dyan to go directly sa kanilang website. Custom Mechanical Keyboard and it is personalized with my name on it. And yes, coating is different. Plate is new. Wala pong ganitong plate. Actually, binili ko po ito. Hindi po siya sponsored. Wala as I have said before. Wala naman siguro designer na mag-shell out ng sobrang laking halaga just to sponsor you with one thing na custom mechanical keyboard. Dahil sobrang rare po ng mga ganito. Parang the opportunity to have one is already a very, very big purse para sa akin. Bibilihin ko to dahil ito na yung magiging reference namin pagdating sa tech reviews. Because that is the intention din naman. Like, it's for hobby and for a reviews reference. Pero, we failed to buy some or the other uh, keyboards or most of the keyboards that are really good dahil nga, uh, wala na. It's uh, limited edition. Your chance to have one is just to buy those uh, much uh, overpriced uh, aftermarket uh, collections like uh, there are offers na around 600,000 300,000 from nung nabili nila yun na sa around uh, 30 or 40 normally mga custom mechanical keyboards actually are just priced at around 20k to 40k anything beyond that it's quite a pricey custom mechanical keyboard. Something very, very special kung meron mang 50K. Yun na yung mga, kumbaga, top end or high end. Pero once na na-release na lahat yun ng designer, sa aftermarket, right after na mabili ng iba, maybe they will sell it at around 100K at least. Lalong-lalo na yung mga top end, like 50K will become 100K, 20K will become 50K, ganun. And this one is... Uh, initially, may nag-offer sa akin ng Matrix 2.0 OG from Vietnam. And ang sinabi niya sa akin, buy mine at around, yun niya, uh, around 100K. Pero, sabi ko, parang ang hirap ko pa rin siyang i-digest na bibilihin ko yung uh, Matrix 2.0 niya for around, uh, yeah, that is OG for ad around that price. So, I came up with an idea na Kung bibili lang din naman ako ng isang mechanical keyboard, then I will uh, spend that much, like 100k or 200k. Dahil yun na lang din naman yung chance ko by then uh, na magkaroon ng Matrix 2.0. So back then, uh, kumbaga, suntok sa buwan, sinubukan ko, why not design or why not magpa-customize ako ng sarili kong akin? Na, kumbaga, I may call it 
if I will spend six digits for a mechanical keyboard, that should be mine. That should be, uh, that should be personally attached sa akin. So, ayun, suntok sa buwan. We tried our best. And uh, luckily, hindi siya busy that time, yung designer. Actually, marami po sila. And he is the only guy, and he is the only designer who allowed me uh, to work with him. And uh, actually, meron pa namang iba. Pero yung level of customization na gusto ko kasi mangyari is parang siya lang yung nakapagsabi na, okay, I can do that for you. Pero wait after one month. So, naghihintay ako ng isang buwan. And he keeps his uh, promise naman. Actually, na-delay. Uh, yung napag-usapang date is hindi natuloy until na-extend na na-extend until... Ayun, finally, yung schedule niya is uh, already uh, okay. And sinabi niya na sa akin, Okay, let's talk about uh, the keyboard. And uh, ayun, sinabi ko, ito yung gusto ko. Nag-offer siya. Sabi ko, uh, I prefer na yung ganito sana, yung Matrix 2.0. Uh, ganito yung setup, not the uh, newer variants or not the older variants. Kasi nga, uh, it will be a daily driver mechanical keyboard for me. And uh, yes, etc. I want the coating like this. Um, I work with the uh, quite a uh, couple of uh, goods pagdating sa hobbies and uh, coating is one of the uh, details na gusto kong na na-appreciate ko pala dito. He told me na lalagyan ko ng lalagay ko yung pangalan mo and at the same time ibahin ko yung Mac Flurry uh, finish and then bibigyan kita ng uh, I mean bib- bebentahan kita ng gradient na plate. So this is the first uh, time that they will release this uh, plate daw sabi niya international and same with this uh, Mac Flurry edition it's the first time they don't know if uh, they will release this pero as of now one is to one po siya ako pa lang po ang merong ganito like uh, maybe they will uh, think about it if uh, they will uh, reproduce this variant if in case well that is yun yung sinabi niya and wow yes dito siya. Sobrang tuwang tuwa ka. Sobra, I mean, grabe. If, yun nga, tuloy nga sabi ko kanina, if there will be a chance or a case na walang-wala na talaga ako and I will sell uh, some of my uh, I mean, things na nandito, this will be one of the last thing na bibitawan ko if in case. Or might be he, maybe hindi ko rin bibitawan. Like, I will still try my best to come up with other solutions, not just to sell this last piece of artwork na meron ako. Something very special. The designer is actually one of the most respected uh, pioneers. I mean, I don't know much how is the history of uh, Matrix Lab, but based on the uh, pricing ng kanilang Matrix 2.0 OG, then it means that they have one of the uh, most valuable uh, mechanical keyboards sa market. Since I'm so speechless, like I cannot still connect the things that I want to state sa sobrang tuwa ko, sa sobrang excited ko, sa sobrang, I mean, very fulfilled sa nangyari with this uh, first custom mechanical keyboard that is personalized uh, for me. Check muna natin yung ating time-lapse video. And yes, couple of sound tests like we have here the aluminum plate and then I tried to uh, use a palm plate with a palm switch, Duroc palm. So, yun po yung mga malalaman natin. The sound signature of Matrix 2.0 additional Mac Flurry edition. Let's check this out and sit back and relax. <music>
So there you have the signature sound of Matrix 2.0 additional with this aluminum plate. Rinig na rinig nyo na how will be a Matrix 2.0 all Matrix components sounds. So ayun yung narinig nyo with this plate. Now of course, uh, there are things na syempre para hindi ako magsawa, I did another setup. It's with a Duroc POM uh, switches and also a POM plate and there you hear yung uh, iba iba yung uh, parang marble sound parang ganun ba yung ganun yung lutong niya ganun yung ganun yung clarity ng kanyang tunog the the uh, Duroc POM with a POM plate sobrang muted and uh, it's same sound signature like a very uh, similar dito pero syempre uh, iba yung pagiging muted kasi ng isang uh, POM plate with a POM switch and XDA keycaps yung ginamit ko pong uh, switch to highlight yung uh, tunog like uh, the sound that I want during usage kasi magiging daily driver ko po siya so something that is uh, quite uh, within my preference and yun po yung uh, ginawa natin actually unang una the setup of this is Cherry MX uh, switch I mean Cherry profile switch pero I ended up using the XDA keycaps na meron ako. And there you have. Uh, you'll be the judge. How is this custom mechanical keyboard? Mac Floor Edition. Do you like it? Or is it within your preference? Do you appreciate this? Still can connect the dots. And for more videos like this, feel free to subscribe. Maybe I will redo and I will share you how is my experience with the most expensive mechanical keyboard that I've got so far. I mean, the most valuable custom mechanical keyboard that I got. Okay, so comment lang po kayo sa baba. And yes, thank you so much.